Hello everybody, welcome back. In this video I'm gonna share with you how to create a promo video under Canva. If you're a realtor or maybe you have um, an idea to sell a house, then this video is the perfect video for you to create a promo video. Stay tuned. By making a promo video for in this case a real estate video or any type of business, it's very important that you understand what kind of video you want to start designing for your potential clients. And it's not that difficult at all to create something, but you really have to have to have a creative side and to know about how do you want to tell your stories by using videos. Because you have to understand that people that are seeing these kind of videos, these are people that are potentially interested in buying a house. By how to do that is I'm going to show that to you in this video by using just Canva software. And I also want to make to into your attention that in this video also I will be using the Canva Pro version of this beautiful amazing software. Well, I'm here already directly under the template of by designing uh, a video and this one is just an empty template. And as you can see here on the left side, you will see a bunch of templates of real estate examples that you can use and change it yourself to create your own branding or create um, video templates or video uh, promo video for your clients that is active in the real estate. But in this case, you make give you an idea how this actually works. I just going to create one from scratch. As you can see here that um, I always think in a couple of ways from when creating a video, you want to make sure that the video is appealing to your audience. So in this section here, the first one, this is a video that is five uh, seconds long, but you can add, add as much as pages and all together, this will be become one entire big video. So let's say the you want to make a video of 30 seconds long so what you can do is you're gonna create 10 slides that that each page is three seconds long but uh, to make it easier for the sake of this uh, video tutorial that I'm recording right now I'm gonna create just a 15 second video with each um, page that will take five seconds long so first of all what I always do is that I'm gonna choose a background that corresponds with the client's branding or color. So let's say that you have a client that is, yeah, is a luxury real estate agency. So when I'm thinking about a real estate agency in the luxury branch, so they sell beautiful houses. So I want to always choose a kind of background that corresponds closely to that um, real estate uh, business itself. So let's say that I like this uh, case of it. I'm gonna add this one all in the three videos of uh, the three pages of this video. So that means that my audience or the people who are watching this video that they already see the branding or the style or the theme of this particular video itself. Well, the next thing what I'm gonna do is um, maybe uh, when you're helping a client in creating a real estate, a promo video for a certain house, that this client has already um, give you a couple of videos or examples that you can use to create this video for them. But in this case, for this video, for this tutorial, I'm gonna choose just a video that I can find under Canva itself. And in this case, I'm gonna just choose real estate. When I do that, you will see a lot of videos here that is related to real estate. But I want to make sure that I choose a video that is similar like the one and another. So I already see a couple of yeah, drone footage videos, which I'm going to add here to um, this sample here. So here I have one and a second one. I'm going to choose another one. It's also a drone footage. And by a third one, there's another one that I found is okay. I like this one as well. So what I'm going to do next is, as you can see here, when I add the videos to each in particular page, that the length of each page is longer. So this one is 15 seconds. 
This one is 10 seconds and the other one is 9 seconds. Because I want to make sure that each and every page or temp slide is um, has the same length. So I'm going to decrease this each to 5 seconds. So I'm going to do the, the same thing by this one. 5 seconds and here also 5 seconds. So in total I have a 15 second video here that I'm going to create. I go back here to the first one and first of all what I really like to do is that to keep it as simple as possible is that I'm gonna ju just use this background here the brownish goldish uh, look uh, template but I'm just gonna create this one like this here and when I play this video here is what you can see is that this video this is what you see during that five seconds but when i play this one here start from here is this is what you're gonna see so just a video and on this side here nothing happens at all oh it's a little bit too fast but i'm gonna do the same thing but uh in the second uh, template here but what i'm gonna do differently here is to keep the audience engaged to to see that it's not boring because if you're showing the same kind of template or same type of um, the way how you have organized each and every slide it may become boring to the people who are watching this video so i want to make sure that i have added a couple of changes here so in the first video you see that the template is been added to the um, or the background is on the right side and in the second video i put it on the left side well, to make it more dynamic and interesting, the last one what I'm going to do is mm, I'm just going to keep this one a little bit to the side here because this, in this case, the third uh, slide here, that is the end of the video. So at the end here, I'm going to add the contact information of my client and also here a sign that says the call to action. So just to make for this video not as long as possible, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add here something um, text so I'm gonna press the T on my keyboard and here I'm gonna say um, are you looking for a house with a nice garden because these are correspondent the people were looking for a house with a garden and also put a question mark behind it and once again this is just a simple way of how you can create a yeah nice looking and what i'm gonna do here i'm gonna make this all in capital letters and also a little bit more bold um, and in this one i'm gonna say mm, e we have just found the right uh, place for you. This one we gotta also put it here. As you can see here in the first one it was white so I'm gonna make the color of the these letters also white so it stands out a little bit more and this happened okay they we found the right place for you how can i get in touch with the client so in this case i'm gonna add another template another part piece of text mm, contact us today and this one i'm gonna put it here And I like everything to be yeah, as smooth as possible, uh, as clear as possible. So then at the bottom here, I gonna add the contact information. Contact us today at mm, one two three Street Road. City name, big city. 
or green town green city Because today, um, yeah, actually, this is the address where the house is all about. So, here and on the bottom here is the real estate company, the uh, real estate uh, experts, and real estate uh, house roads. I just take on something number one and then the phone number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And here, what you can do here, you have an idea. And in this case, as you can see that this, yeah, this piece of text is visible in the video itself. But what I'm gonna do here, just for the sake of this video, I'm gonna add something nice and fun. As you can see here, it corresponds already a little bit more with the theme of this, uh, the branding colors that I'm using for this particular video. And I'm gonna choose this one. I'm gonna. This one, I'm gonna make it a little bit smaller so they know which address this is. And I'm gonna create a little bit of an animation. And here, and this one is how it? just to make the video a little bit more dynamic and this one i'm gonna make it beat a little bit more and here you are and with this gun is one how can you do that the house second one just found the house for you or just make it more dynamic and we also get to do here now is oops something that goes wrong a little bit more so and this also ascend so let's see how this video turns out so in less than five minutes i just created a 15 second video for a real estate agency but as you can see here you can add more elements so let you see uh, see that this text stands out a little bit more you can add some extra effects like a shadow in this case the shadow i'm gonna put it in the color blue or black and also the offset a little bit the blur the transparency is something a bit less so it stands out a little bit more or what you also can do is mm, yeah create other effects like that if that's your kind of thing um, but I'm gonna keep it like this and we're gonna just see how this video looks like now as you can see here I haven't added any music yet but here you already have an idea what you can create by using just Canva itself and you can get, make it as fancy or as professional looking as you want for yourself but always take into consideration the request or the taste that or the branding that your client wants to. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you have some questions related to this video, you want to know more about how to create a promo video under Canva, feel free to put your questions in the comment sections below. And also press the like video if you have learned something from this video as well and share it with your friends for those who might also benefit or be interested in a video like this. So thank you for watching, don't forget to, to subscribe to this channel and in the meanwhile you can watch these videos that are related also to this video to know more about how to use Canva for your designs here on by using this amazing platform. So thank you for watching and I see you soon in my next video here on my channel.